There's a growing need for home care across the country, and Michigan is no exception. Yeah, in tonight's Rebound Report, we hear from one local company doing all it can to attract more workers to help those who need it. Infallible Home Care provides daily assistance to people inside their homes. Whether they're elderly or injured or in recovery, we're there to try to help them do daily routine things that they're not able to do themselves. Growing slowly and steadily since their start back in 2018, they say they quickly saw a change one year ago when the lockdowns began. As time progressed, um, the caregiver has kind of uh, faded off and the clients now have increased. They say the increase in need for their services came partly from families choosing to take loved ones out of larger facilities. And this is not just our company. And I know two particular families that just yanked their family members out of where they were because they weren't able to see them. They weren't able to be there for them. And the loss of caregivers they attribute at least partly to the increase and in extension of unemployment. We have to turn people away because we don't have the staff to take care of them. A study by PHI, Paraprofessionals Healthcare Institute, a nonprofit working to ensure quality care for older adults and adults with disabilities, shows a statewide shortage in Michigan of 34,000 caregivers. And PHI predicted right before the pandemic 178,000 job openings in this field from 2018 to 2028 in Michigan due to growth and turnover. Infallible says they could nearly double their staff right now. Even that would only cover them for a few weeks. We're about at 12 and could add at least 10 more. Yeah, easily. Yeah. easily. And unfortunately, they fear their employee shortage may get worse once the COVID hazard pay bump for direct care workers ends, which is scheduled to wrap up October 1st. Everybody's grumbling behind the scenes, but really it needs to come to the forefront because we've got people out there that really need help. In the meantime, Parker Tunnell doing all she can to attract more workers. Although not specific with the amount, they're calling it a good starting pay rate. She pays start out pay higher than anybody that I've ever worked for in Michigan. But we're offering sign on bonuses and it does go up based on experience. They also allow workers to build their own hours, provide paid training and are adding insurance benefits soon, trying to strike a delicate balance of helping both her caregivers and those in need of care right now. What it really takes for a good caregiver is to have the empathy and the compassion and the willingness and the willingness to care about somebody in their community that might need help. Now, Infallible says they always try to place workers in homes close to their home and nursing home uh, nursing degree is not required because they do not administer medications or shots. But for much more information about Infallible Home Care, just check out our web story right now. If you know of a person or group helping others get back on their feet during the pandemic, let us know. Call the number on your screen or send an email to rebound at fox17online.com.